A diesel electric plant supplies energy for Moralco. During a 24 hour period, the plant consumed 240 gallons of fuel at 28 degrees C. So the volume of our fuel at 28 degrees C is 240 gallons. And produced 3930 kilowatt hours of power. Let's call that our work. Industrial fuel used is 28 degrees API gravity. And was purchased at 30 pesos per litre at 15.6 degrees C. So at 15.6 degrees C, the cost is 30 pesos per litre. What is the cost of the fuel to produce one kilowatt hour? Let's say that is C. Uh, cost is peso per kilowatt hour. So the first clue we have here is our API gravity, which has this formula. So if, if we input our API given here, it's 28 degrees C. Oh, sorry, not C, just 28 degrees. And uh, we get an SG of... If you put this in our calculator, we get an SG of 0.887. Next, we should take into account the correction factor as well. So it has this formula. And then we input our the temperature we want to convert it to. So in this case, it is 28 degrees C minus 15.6. And we should get a correction factor of 0 0.991. And now we can get the specific gravity of our fuel at 28 degrees C. So that is simply this one, 0.887, multiplied by our correction factor. And we should arrive at a value of 0.879. So now I will write down the relationship between specific gravity, uh, specific gravity and the volume. So on the left, we have 15.6 degrees C multiplied by the volume at 15.6 degrees C. Same thing on the right, but it is at 28 degrees C. Okay. So V28 degrees C is given. That is uh, 240 gallons. SG28 is right here, so that is 0.879. Finally, SG15.6 is over here. This is 0.8787. And using shift solve, we would arrive at a value of 273.835 gallons. Now, before we use this, we should convert it into liters first because the cost is in a per liter basis. For every gallon, we have 3.785 liters. So these two cancel out and we get a volume of 900.21 liters. So now we can use dimensional analysis in order to find our cost of the fuel to produce one kilowatt hour. So this is 900.21 liters. The cost at 15.6 degrees C will allow us to eliminate the liters. So these cancel out. 
we now have our peso. And in order to find our kilowatt hour, you can simply divide this, or rather multiply this by the reciprocal of 3930 kilowatt hours. Okay, so the units now match. We can safely put this in our calculator and uh, we get cost of 6.87 peso per kilowatt hour. And that is our final answer. If this helped you, consider liking, subscribing and supporting me on Patreon.